if I point this too high, the Mount Tohara goes out of focus, but if I just bring it down lower, you can see across the water there, that's Mount Tohara. So we're looking out across um, the lake here to Tohara. So Lake Taupo, the biggest lake, not only in New Zealand, but the Southern Hemisphere. It's a massive, massive body of water. It actually came to be because it used to be a volcano a couple of thousand years ago. Blew up and just, you know, created a massive crater in the central North Island. And then what happened after that, gradually over time, filled up with water. And I might add, that eruption when it happened a couple of thousand years ago, was seen in China. It was actually, it turned the sky red in China and other countries. Quite incredible really, so a massive eruption recorded in human history and then gradually over time fills up. And what's interesting, the lake never actually used to be this high. So this lake um, is much, much, you know, fuller than it used to be. Down that end of the lake where there's the control gates, um, that actually, you know, moderates the, the lake level. So what actually happens is that's not a bad thing for um, some of the, the sort of fish life and the, the food that um, feeds the trout in the lake. So often when the lake has been high, the fishing has been quite good. It's quite interesting. There seems to be a band near the shoreline where a lot of the sort of smelt, they sort of uh, breed, you know, feed, that sort of stuff, ha you know, exist, habit you know, their habitation. Um, so when the lake is full, it's not bad for fishing at all. And the fish that we've pulled out just in the, the few days that have been here, it's been pretty incredible. The condition of the fish has been great. And, you know, abundant too, but yeah, this is an incredible spot. Lake Topol, great history behind it too.